Hello. In Positive Intelligence by Shirzad Shamin, which is a, a New York bestseller, um, which I've been reading recently, he talks about the two main parts of our brain. I think there's three, actually, but the two main parts are the primitive part, which protects us from danger, um, which we rely on ex extensively as we're growing up. And then you've got the uh, the more modern brain, the you know, the prefrontal cortex part of the brain, the, the higher brain. And he talks about these things called neural pathways. And what happens is we get into habits caused by these neural pathways, because if something happens and we react in a certain way over and over again, the pathways in the brain that lead to that particular type of behavior get bigger and bigger. And the pathways that lead to alternative types of behavior get narrower and narrower. And then he talks about what tends to happen with many people is that these neural pathways send us down to these things called saboteurs in our primitive brains. There's 10 of them, the main one being the judge. And the judge is basically the one that criticizes everything, criticizes other people, criticizes yourself, criticizes the world in general, but also tells you things like, you know, you don't deserve it, you're not good enough, et cetera, et cetera. So it's, the, it's these sabotars of which the leading one is the judge and there's nine others. They're the ones that stop you um, being happy and contented and achieving your full potential. Whereas in the more modern, highly developed part of the brain, you've got these things called sage characters. And the sage characters, they're things like being resourceful, creative, empathy, um, pos basically the positive characteristics that we want to encourage. They're called sage characters. And he goes, he, go, he, he outlines some strategies which will enable you to develop neural pathways taking you up towards the sage behaviors <clears throat> and not taking you towards the um, <clears throat> the saboteur behaviors. It's really fascinating. So the moral of the story is that we need to develop strategies and ways to move towards our higher behaviors, if you like, which are caused by our sage characters rather than our lower behaviors and our more negative behaviors, which are attributable to these saboteurs and it's basically the certain strategies you can pursue to um, achieve that if you're interested in how being with other positive minded people could actually help you set ambitious goals and achieve those goals have a look at businessroundtableuk.co.uk which explains how uh, if you're part of an accountability or mastermind group or advisory board or whatever you want to call it you're anything from two to five times more likely to achieve what you say you're going to do than if you're not being held accountable. So Bernard Keevy explaining how positive intelligence by Shirzad Shamin explains ways in which you can get in touch with your sage characters in your brain rather than your saboteurs led by this nasty judge character. Hope you found that interesting and useful. Thanks very much for watching.